Good morning everyone, this is Ranger Rob with the Ranger Rob Country Living. I want to make sure I say hello to all the new subscribers we have. Thank you so much. Please take the time to like and share our videos, it really helps. So today uh, I'm doing my normal chores, but at the same time, as you know, I've been talking about hydroponics. And so, uh, talk about sleepless nights trying to engineer this stuff. So we actually have got things on order now. Let me get out of the wind a little bit here. Uh, number one thing is I had to get my woven fabric. So the entire greenhouse, everything that we're doing with the hydroponics will have woven, um, <laughs> woven fabric on the ground. Uh, one is because uh, it's good quality, but two, it uh, absorbs water and so uh, uh, that's going to be important so that's been on order we had to order some other things like uh, I didn't have a good uh, fence post pounder so I got one of those and a fence post removal tool to get them out of the ground and so uh, yeah kind of like all the early stages of things have been ordered uh, we also ordered a hand uh, a stack of five uh, growing pots that are kind of shaped like oh the best way to say it would be like a clover which would be stackable put on rods and uh, so once we get those I can measure them start determining how to make our poles and uh, been studying pumps and uh, yeah it's just amazing and uh, even though I'm spending money on that kind of stuff, it's still cheaper than lumber. And once again, sorry about the wind. So it's a beautiful day. Uh, I'm going to do my normal chores. Getting very excited to get the plastic put on this thing. It's ready to go. We just got to... I can't do it alone. So once I get the manpower, uh, we bought a... 50 foot wide piece of plastic like 35 feet long and uh, we have to cut it first because a main piece will go all the way across and then these here in the front uh, the, the extra pieces we cut off these are going to be put on permanent uh, so we're not using wiggle wire at the lower halves these will be kind of permanently put on and uh, but the sides uh, as it drapes down, it'll be connected to the wiggle wire there, connected to white wiggle wire here, down here. This will be able to roll up. So we got wiggle wire here to hold the sides, and at the bottom, we're going to use PVC pipe so we can roll the sides up so we can let this greenhouse breathe in the summer. Uh, there'll be a window in the back. Uh, <laughs> Dogs are going to be sad when the walls go up here. And this screen door opens up for breathing. Then we'll determine what kind of fan we might need in here. And in the winter, I've been seeing people using the Mr. Buddy, uh, Buddy Heater Propane Systems they, uh, if I want to put heat in this uh, greenhouse. So anyway, guys, let me go uh, feed my chickens and then I'll talk more. I got the... Uh, chickens fed gave them a lot more hay to play with and uh when i do that they keep making more and more compost and that's a good thing and uh check our eggs two there oh we've been busy again let me grab these eggs well today we got nine eggs and uh <laughs> can't argue with that especially in the winter so uh, I am really anxious for the weather to turn here a little bit because we have a lot of work to do now. So this garden is going to be a lot different because I'm not going to uh, add put additives in it or anything. It's all going to be covered in weave um, and uh, We'll probably do our all of our broccoli and um, well, things not not broccoli, but pretty much like our carrots 
and uh, radishes and stuff like that over here in the corner. But out here, aquaponics in corn. So it's gonna be damn interesting. <laughs> so uh, I hope yesterday's videos, there was a couple we're doing on homesteading, being prepared. I really urge you guys to go back and watch those. Uh, after watching the Texas thing, and uh, some of the comments, like, how am I, how am I going to boil water? Really? Come on, people. Um, even if you're a city slicker and stuff, there's some camping gear out there that you can buy that's just great for emergencies and great for camping. <laughs> and uh, really not that big investment. Just make sure you have water. Make sure you have some dried food. And... Uh, something to heat water with and somebody asked me what a Berkey was and uh, it's a water filter system there's several out there but that's one of the easiest and for an apartment get a little one save yourself a little bit of money they are pricey you're looking at two hundred dollars and better so uh, but hey if it snows and you lose your power and stuff you need water grab the snow put it in the Berkey if you have a pool at your apartment, go steal some of the water out of it. Put it through your Berkey. Uh, there's no reason not to have water. Of course, buy bottled water. That's the way to go. And uh, uh, as I'm learning hydroponics, I'm learning a lot about vertical growing. There's a lot you could grow right on the, uh, your uh, patio of your apartment. And I hope I'm trying to... Uh, address people in small areas now if you got a little bit of a lot um, you know a property a what, one eighth acre or whatever they call it um, you can do a lot on that a whole lot amazing amounts with very little space so uh, anyway uh, really my goal uh, this month on uh, being prepared uh, no, I'm not saying shit's going to hit the fan. I'm saying for emergencies. Uh, we don't really have too many emergencies here in Oregon. But that's what you guys said in Texas, too. So, uh, yeah, just be... Uh, now, I'm on a different scale, I think, than most people. Uh, we're we're uh, set up for six months to a year. And as soon as we get our freeze dryer in... Uh, and start canning some of that stuff um, we'll be prepared for well over a year and be able to take care of Sherry's mother-in-law if we had to bring her back here and if family got in a pickle we'd be there for them so anyway guys I, I hope that's good advice please take the time to like subscribe and share our videos all over the whole wide world we'd appreciate it help us out thank you for being a subscriber and if you're not, please hit the subscribe bell and don't uh, button and hit the little bell. It kind of gives you a reminder we have a new video out. So guys, uh, be safe and we'll talk to you later. Bye now. Our videos are made possible by Ranger Rob Poopy Bags. Available at Amazon right now. Thank you very much for watching our video. Please take the time to like, subscribe, and share our videos all over the whole wide world. Thanks.